Yo, what's up guys? This weekend I'm gonna be going to Atlanta, Georgia and I wanna take you guys with me because I'm gonna see one of my huge inspirations on YouTube, which is Inky Johnson. Yes, you guys guessed it. Not because it's on the title or anything, but yeah, he was a huge inspiration for me when you know I was at my worst in life. I'm pretty sure everybody has hit that before, their worst in life somewhere downhill. So this is a really huge opportunity for me to, you know, go and see him live and hopefully meet him and get a picture and ask him questions. I'm at the airport right now. We're just checking in our bags. Um, I probably need some Starbucks. My head is hurting really bad right now. I'm gonna need some hot tea or something. It's a honey mitris, honey citrus mint tea. Sounds really good right now with some extra honey. It's pretty weird vlogging here because it's very quiet. It's really early right now. It's about 6 a.m. And everybody's kind of looking at me. Do you think I'm weird? Now I know how it feels. It's okay. I think I'm cool. <laughs> so right now we just got through TSA. Say what's up, Mama. This is Mama right here. Say what's up, Mom. Or not. Never mind. What's up? What's up? Yeah. This is. These are the two that you know made me right here. Happy what Brandon is eating in the morning. Yeah, she's eating the rest of the sausage and buffet. I didn't really eat this. Look at my mom, bro. We're always packed. You know how us Spanish Asians food. do? You know how Asians do? My mom always packs. She says she got the brown rice for me. She brought brown rice, which is really clutch. All right, it's a little weird. I got a honey citrus mint tea, and they put the honey in for you ready. They have honey pumps, which is kind of weird because I work at Starbucks too at school, and we don't put, we don't have pumps. We just have like that little packet, and good. we can't open it for them. So it's like a health policy thing, so. Yeah, I bought her too. She's sick. We're both kind of sick. We have a headache, so this is perfect for us. Yeah. I don't really drink Starbucks or tea, hot tea, but uh, we made it into the plane. We had a one-hour delay because of the weather. It's really, it's really cold and rainy outside. Really wet. This plane is super small. It only fits to an aisle. I never had that. my dad. Oh, I'm carry carry my mom. Yeah, just filming, vlogging. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, the flight is good to about 30 minutes to San Francisco. After that, we're going to take a five hour flight to Georgia. After that, we're just going to relax and sleep and then just wait for this weekend. All right, guys, a quick little update. We are in our second flight to Georgia. Our other flight, like I said, was delayed. And our next flight was like at 10 30, and we got here like at 10 15. So we ran our ass all the way to the second flight. Luckily, they were still open. The tray will have to go at least. Alright, just ruined my vlog. It's okay. While we were running, you know those fast escalators and all this stuff? We were running on that, and we were sprinting. It felt like I was flying. I don't know if it was healthy or not, but it felt, I felt like I was flying. So it was pretty cool. This plane is a lot bigger from the other one. This one is more roomy. Mama came in clutch. This is why you, I love going with my mom. Traveling with your mom brings you the food. This is why we have women in the world. They really save our asses. Right, Dad? <laughs> we're about two hours in. We have about two more hours. And we're going to be playing some cards. It's clutch. We forgot cards at home. So we bought some in the airport before we left. We are in Atlanta, Georgia right now. This airport is really big. It's beautiful here. I can smell the new fresh air in the East Coast right now. I'm starving, so you know where I'm gonna go. I'm gonna eat some pho right now. Nothing beats pho, and I've heard that Georgia pho is really good, so. I'm a big pho guy. I know all the good places, especially Fresno. Fresno has the best pho, but we'll see. Everyone says Georgia's is good, so we'll test that out. We made it to the pho place, pho dai loi. I don't know if this is good. I saw the ratings. We got about 1,000 ratings, four and a half stars. Let's check this out. Oh, this is our rental car. Look at that Jeep. This is the car I want. Not this color, but this is exactly the car I want. Usually when I go to photo places, I always look for this chili oil right here. If they have no chili oil, then I don't like the place. I automatically just don't like it. It's just not good without it. Okay, foe is out. The broth looks really good. It's not dark, not too light. Looks good. Haven't tried it yet, but I got extra flank over here. Oh man, this this is the spot. The noodle 
those are a little bit um, soggier than home. It's still solid. I'm not too picky about pho. It's almost pho is pho for me. And plus, we had like a six hour flight, so I'm really hungry, so it doesn't really matter. But overall, nothing beats homemade pho or Fresno pho. All right, we made it to our hotel. Now we're just gonna rest up, shower, and yeah, tomorrow's gonna be the big day, one of the big days, except tomorrow and Saturday. Yeah, I feel really bloated from that pho. That, even though that pho wasn't that good, it was, they give you a lot of portion. So right now I'm pretty bloated. I'm just gonna, you know, shower and then knock out, rest up for tomorrow. We have to be there really early. Luckily, the convention is in our hotel. Just a little heads up, I did get right, a haircut, so as you can day. see, I decided to cut it when we came to Georgia because it was really long and it was bothering me, it looked really ugly, so I did get a haircut, like so you guys are not uh, crazy, gosh, and my hair just magically just got time. shorter. He said, you know, we might not get to meet him, he's very busy, he has to leave really early, but we'll see, hopefully. Crossing my fingers. Oh my god, yes! I got exactly what I wanted coming here to Georgia. I finally got to meet Inky Johnson. I was looking around the convention the whole time, like every minute, because they were saying, oh, he's gonna be here soon, he's gonna be here soon. I just kept looking, looking, looking. I was like, man, I'm just waiting for him to come, because I want a picture before, you know, because after he talks, he doesn't have a lot of time taking pictures. I was fortunate enough to get him before his speech and I went up to him, shook his hand, as you saw, and I asked him for a picture and he's, with no hesitation, he said, yeah, sure, man, I would love to. I was like, bro, it really got me. I was like, man, this guy, he's amazing. He's such a nice guy, you know. I've seen, you know, on YouTube, people meeting the celebrities and all that stuff and they're all rude and everything. This guy, he's totally opposite from that. He is what he really is. Inky Johnson, such a great guy inspiring everything i'm glad i met him you know he really helped me when i was at my lowest about a year ago so it was an honor to meet him if you guys don't know who eking johnson is i'll leave a link down below and you guys can check him out that's gonna be one of my favorite videos of him i always listen to him during my workouts i'll leave a link down below definitely check him out he definitely changed my life a year ago and i hope to you know change the younger generation's lives too i want them to be better than how I was. I don't want them to, you know, make the same mistakes as I did or at least learn what I learned that was too late earlier than me. I think that makes sense. Okay, right now, tonight is a special night. This is an awards night tonight and my mom said I'm getting an award, so I'm pretty nervous. There's a lot of people. Number one. And 
you know what? I said all the thank yous, but I do have one here today. If it was for all those kids at home, I wouldn't be able to do it. And of course, the team. Brandon, would you run up here, please? We wouldn't have been able to be up here if you were not with us at home and here. All right, guys, this was not planned at all. I was so surprised when she called my name to go up there while she was making her two-minute speech uh, from her big award that they both achieved. But, you know, I'm happy that I got to share that moment with them up there. For my two men that are standing up here with me, thank you so much for all of the opportunity, Phil and Debbie and everybody. And you know what? The only thing you have to do is believe yourself, listen to yourself, follow what you want, and your dream will never end, and it's just the beginning of us. And here's the man who helped me. In order to become somebody, I believe it. Uh, this is the greatest opportunity in this country, and uh, anybody can do it. So just keep continuing to do it. FFS already have your name in the office to recognize. So please work hard, and you are not late. Thank you. Oh man, what a tiring day! It was a really cool day. I got awards. My parents got a lot of awards. Um, yeah, right now we're just gonna celebrate. Why not? We're gonna go and drink, grab a couple of beers, shots, just I don't know, have fun. We're in Georgia, so we just have fun. Being around uh, all these business people, it's changing my mindset. I really like it. Um, this is why I've been spending a lot of time, you know, with my parents, um, doing the business and all that stuff. So it's definitely something, you know, us and us youngsters like in the 20s should, you know, consider doing. Business is the way to go, you know, money never ends. If you guys are interested in what business my parents do or what I got into, you can find my information down there. I'll put my information there, my Instagram, my Facebook, email, all that stuff down there. So, yeah, just hit me up and send me a message if you guys want to know. I'll be more than welcome to um, tell you guys what we do. Wow, who would have knew Georgia was this pretty? Look at that. Very nice, look at that. A lot of um, restaurants, a lot some pho, there's a Thai kitchen, hot pot. Yeah, Man, this is crazy. I didn't expect this from Georgia. Okay, I've been craving some sushi lately. Ever since uh, the Hmong New Year's when I was with Cindy, I've been craving crazy. I've been really crazy about sushi. Ooh, look at my sushi. We got some eggs, we got some raw. I don't know what that is. I don't know what kind of. Oops. I don't know what kind of meat that is. I kind of forgot. It just, they had pictures on the menu. It looked really good. I just, I want this. <laughs> There's some shrimp tempura in here though. There's spicy mayo for sure. I always gotta get spicy mayo. This one's for my mom. She likes to eat, you know, she doesn't like raw. All right, guys. Toast. Toast. Thank you guys, you know, for taking me here to Georgia. Big opportunity for me. Thank you. Toast. Happy New Year's, guys. <laughs> he wanted to go to the lounge. We're gonna go to the club. Yeah. Hey, Dad, you wanna go to strip club? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I feel so bloated after eating all that sushi and my beer. But yeah, I wanted to talk to you guys about Georgia. My whole trip here was amazing. I love the convention. The people here are so nice. All these business people here. I've learned so much. I've talked to many of the agents here, just like my parents. Uh, see different types of you know stories views all that. Oh my gosh. It was so bright But yeah, I got a chance to meet all these you know people from around the world from uh, Different countries different states here. Also, I got to see Inky Johnson, which is really cool for me It was like a dream come true. You know, I've seen his all his videos on YouTube I know his whole story. It's kind of weird, but yeah, I know his whole story I listen to him, you know when I work out huge huge inspiration You guys should definitely check him out if you know you just need that motivation or just watch him in general He's just a great guy a lot of people don't like to hang out with their parents But for me, I like to hang out with my parents because I realize how cool they really are with all these you know people <laughs> and It's very sad, you know as my parents are getting older. I'm getting older So right now is the best time to you know hang out with them and appreciate their presence because we don't know when they're gonna be gone. I know I'm not pretty active on this account. I'm more active on um, my other account with Cindy. Um, Link is down to Brandon and Cindy. But this year, 2020, I want to be more active on this channel and Brandon and Cindy. So I will be keeping you guys updated frequently. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share this channel for more videos like this. But yeah, thank you guys. I love all you guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video.